click like and subscribe please okay so here we've got block drain it's all over the air uh, over the backyard i'll show you now all right so i'm currently in a place called press cut the weather's beautiful as you can see so here there you go so it's all coming off out of your area so at first sight, I first have to cut into that, find the access there, and then there's a gully there. If you look closely, there's a little manhole just there. Actually, just here, so let's see what's going on in this. Should be full, it's all there in the banks. So there you go. So it's literally just caught on the outlet there. Let's set up here so you can see enough of it. So yeah, there's literally just on the outlet there. So get me worm jetter, give it a good poke, a good blast through, and that'll uh, get rid of everything. So bear with me. Okay, so first, let's with the outlet, see if it comes gushing. High pressure jet. Okay. So this is what's called the worm jetter, the smallest one we use. towards me everything that's left on the bottom of it.
Right, so I'll pop you on the head cam as I get the disinfectant and give all this a good, a good clean down. Okay, okay. Pop you on the head cam. Disinfectant. Disinfectant brush and you're good to go. Oh, telephone is a ring ringing. You alright, Jen? Another job off, Jenny. Send through. Right, so. Made the likes of this one now. Fact. What I'll do first, just turn that engine off for a sec, just to save petrol. There's no point burning through my petrol whilst you're brushing up. And I'll come back and turn that on. Someone commented on me whistling being awful the other day. I was hoping, I'm hoping they're going to send me a recording of their whistling to tell me exactly how it should be done. I didn't know there was a, a manual to, to whistling. Broke me heart. Went to whistling college for four years. I went to whistling college for. Obviously didn't do me any good. Jen went to shrubbery school in, I think it was 66, during the World Cup. Right, so get all your excess. Yeah. All these here to knock at that grid cover. It's all snapped around there. We've got another one in the van. More wipes as well. Ah, that's what I was doing. Move this out the way here. So yeah, so basically now I just brush everything into the manhole. She's got an outside tap as well, which is decent. And just get all the excess in there. I think we're going to start getting a few more videos off, uh, off Jem and Joe on their own in the near future, hopefully. That'll be off soon for a few weeks with the baby coming. That's best up everywhere. Okay, I'll go leave that tap on in a sec, actually, and I'll turn this back on and, uh, and give it a good hose down first and then throw all the disinfectants on to Let's get it on.
We always like the comments of people who always like to sort of slate our game of how we do it. But yeah, we're not seeing no videos off off of them, of them doing their game. Whether it be drainage or something else. So they're all like pointing the finger. But them type of people normally can't handle it. And it come, it's on the other foot, so please show us what you do because that'll be entertaining for us to look at as well. Pressure back off again. Ah, sorry for the snitch, and it's when the weather's damp. Sinuses are. Yeah, when the weather's damp, my sinuses are terrible. So, apologies if you're getting a big. <coughs> and yes, speakers. Yeah, she's obviously cut this. To make it fit in there, so we'll leave that. Oh, it is. I did snap and snap around there. All right. It's all being sat on top of there too. No doubt somebody has said, Why didn't you use the hose to clean it rather than do that? No. Why didn't you wake up with a positive attitude this morning, fellow commenter? Positivity. I feel like that's just all the mud from all the moss and stuff everywhere too. And it's raining. So that will get rid of any other bits also. Okay, well I'm happy with that. The 
customer isn't in at the minute, so they've let me left me access for me to uh, to crack on, which is good. Good trust from the Mersey Rod team. There you go. Okay. Nice quick one. More of a clean up. No job really did anything today. Not that any yet. Can't do a flush test on this one with them not being in. So the drains are running fine for when I'm throwing water down and going and brushed everything through. It's all clean. If they get a call back and they say that the toilet's still blocked, which I doubt it, just purely from me getting right up in the soil stack. But if it was to be, then that's obviously been a separate issue to that one as well. So that's fine. My next job. Bit of a drive now over to uh, to Chester for my next job. Right. Okay, closed. Job done. Don't forget, click like and subscribe. Thank you very much.